Hey guys, so today I am going to be showing you all my hair cleansing routine. Now this is very important to do at least twice a month because this is very essential if you want to have a healthy scalp or if you want to grow your hair faster. So I'm going to be showing you guys step by step on how I do it. So let's get started. Okay, so I'm right now here in my garden and I'm going to harvest an aloe vera. I'll pro I could probably use just one leaf of this. I'm gonna go ahead and cut this right here. Right there, just gonna be using one. And I'm also going to be getting some um, lavender leaves right here. I'm also gonna get some rosemary. I'm just gonna pick some, just like that. Maybe just to stop. Okay, so what I have in here is the pink Himalayan salt, and this is really great for detoxifying the scalp. So I added it in there. And then I'm going to be taking about one tablespoon of brown sugar. After that, I'm going to be adding in the honey. A little bit of honey. And this is going to be my scalp scrub. Right, so in here I have water, and now I'm going to pour in some apple cider vinegar because I'm going to make this as a rinse on my hair, or a pre-rinse on my hair, about just about that much. I'm going to add in some rosemary and then the lavender leaves in there, and I'm just going to let them soak for a while. And the lavender and the rosemary is actually going to tame down the smell of the um, apple cider vinegar. So in here I'm going to use my salt, sugar and honey scrub and then I will apply that onto my scalp. And then after that I will use the aloe vera. So in here I'm just going to peel the thorny side of it and then cut it into small pieces like this. So here's what I do. So first I apply the scalp scrub and then I massage that with the aloe vera. And I find that this is actually very soothing on the scalp and it is not abrasive as well if you do this technique. And I really like this whole routine because it exfoliates and detoxifies your scalp while it moisturizes it as well. And then after that, I will do a five minute scalp massage. Now for the bottom part of my hair, I will be using the ACD rinse that is infused with lavender and the rosemary herb. And I will be soaking my hair in there for 30 minutes. Now it's best to use a plastic bag when you do this, just so that you don't end up walking around holding the pail with you. All right, so after 30 minutes, I'm going to rinse it out with water and then just use my clear shampoo. Now, I really love the fresh smell of this shampoo. Plus, it has five essential oils, namely rosemary, lavender, bergamot, grapefruit, and tea tree oil that are all great for hair growth and keeping your scalp healthy. And I will not only use this on my scalp, but I will use this all over my hair because I want it to clean and get rid of the smell of the ACV. And this is also the reason why I don't use the ACV as a last rinse for my hair because I don't want my hair to smell pungent after. So that's why a good smelling shampoo would be very ideal to use if I soak my hair in the apple cider vinegar for a long time. So after that, I will just rinse it up with water. I will no longer use conditioner because I want my hair to just breathe and not have any products in it. So that's the whole purpose of this routine to just detoxify my hair. And then after that, I will air dry it. All right, you guys, so this is the result of my hair. As I've said, I really like doing this routine once or twice a month just to get rid of all of the product buildup on my scalp, dirt or excess oils that sometimes can cause dandruff or can make my hair look way down. Especially during the hot weather here in my country. It's actually the rainy season in my country right now, but it is still very hot. So I tend to sweat a lot. That's why I am washing my hair often just because I don't like my hair to smell and I really like using my clear shampoo because it cleans my hair very well and at the same time it does not dry out my scalp or my hair and I actually do like that even though I did not use conditioner on my hair at all the bottom part of my hair still feels very soft and smooth which is a great plus for me so if you are in the Philippines I invite you to as well try out the shampoo and make the clear upgrade because right now this comes in all new liquid fresh formula 
infused with 100% natural botanical extracts, it has 100% natural ingredients, zero colorants, it has no parabens, and it gives you a clean, dandruff-free hair with the power of nature. If you all are looking for anti-dandruff shampoo or just a shampoo for dry and itchy scalp, this can help you as well. So that is it for now, you guys. I hope you all like this video. And if you did, please give this video a thumbs up. And I'll see you on my next one. Bye.